And in the Hadith of Dajjal, which is cited in the book later, Tamim al-Dari, uh, the Hadith of Tamim al-Dari, Dajjal later asks Tamim al-Dari, how do the Arabs live? Do they still live in their tents? It's an interesting question because yeah. in the end of times, they will shift from their tents to these tall constructions, these tall buildings. Well, you mentioned the Dajjal. I mean, who is the Dajjal? Uh, I mean, for someone who doesn't know anything about this subject, what, what are we talking about? We're talking about an individual, a historical person who will come in the future. And what are the signs <clears throat> of his coming? But the correct position is a Dajjal is an individual who was uh, created by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is and will appear as a Messiah in the end of times, starting from the direction of Khurasan, then Asfahan, Khurasan being in Afghanistan, he will make his descent into Asfahan, which is in modern day Iran, and then going to cities like Basra and Al-Kufa, and then going to Syro-Palestine. When he enters Syro-Palestine,